Do you dread writing cover letters for job applications? Are you unsure of what companies are really looking for in a great cover letter? Or if you even need to submit one? If you're confused and overwhelmed about cover letters, you're not alone. They can definitely be intimidating, but don't worry. Today we're diving deep into six steps to write an amazing cover letter, including when you should and shouldn't submit one, how to properly format your cover letter, and how to engage a recruiter or hiring manager with compelling content. Hey, I'm Heather, a career strategy expert, helping you land your next big career opportunity so you can grow in a field you love. Now, if you have not yet done so, make sure you click the subscribe button down below and remember to tap the bell notification so you're notified when I host a live training or publish a new video every week here on my channel. And hey, before we get started, if you have not yet grabbed your copy of the Career Advancement Toolkit, be sure to snag it today. It's an exclusive suite of resources designed to help you land more interviews and better job offers. We're talking video lessons, instructions, templates, guides, and checklists to help you put your best foot forward and secure your next position with confidence and ease. I'll place a special limited time link for you in the description below. Whether you're applying for a senior level position or entering the workforce for the very first time, writing an engaging, impactful cover letter will not only help you land your ideal position, it will also help you provide leverage when entering the salary negotiation phase. Now here's the thing, as a career strategy expert who has helped thousands thousands of job seekers secure new positions, I can say with confidence that unless a company specifically says not to send a cover letter, you need to include a cover letter with your application. So with that being said, let's jump into the six tips to help you make an outstanding cover letter that gets you hired and secures a life-changing job offer. The first step to write an amazing cover letter is to use consistent formatting. You wanna organize your cover letter in a way that is clear and easy to follow. HR managers read resumes and cover letters at lightning speed, so you have to make a great first impression fast. The perfect length for a cover letter is four paragraphs on one page. We'll talk more about each paragraph in just a minute, but remember that if your cover letter goes past one page, it's not likely that the second page will even get read. The short, consistent paragraphs will make it easy for the hiring manager to navigate and find the information they're looking for quickly. With that being said, if you're sending your cover letter as an attachment in an email or in an application system, or if you're planning on printing out your cover letter, begin your cover letter with a header. Very similar to the header you'd place on your resume. And if you're not sure of how to write an incredible resume, take a look at this video right here where I share five simple steps to write a standout resume that lands you more interviews and better job offers. I'll also place a link for you down below. So the header on your cover letter should include your full name, a contact phone number, your city and state, and your zip code, not your entire mailing address. It should include your email address and your LinkedIn URL. After the header, include the date followed by the contact information of the person and the company you're applying with. This includes the person's name, which we'll talk more about in just a second, the person's title, the person's department, and the company name and address. If your cover letter is not going to be sent as an attachment to an email, uploaded to an application system or printed out, you can copy and paste the letter into the body of an email. In this case, you won't need to use the header, the date, or name and address of the company. Now for the rest of your cover letter, match the formatting you used on your resume, including the font style, the font size, and even the margin. Your cover letter should look like it goes with your resume and both documents should look professional and attractive. Now tell me in the comments down below, are you starting your cover letter from scratch or do you already have one created? Step number two to write an amazing cover letter is to customize your greeting. Now one way to really stand out as a top candidate and to help move your application forward quickly is to customize your greeting. Whenever possible, use the name of the person who will be conducting the interview. Get creative and do some digging to find out who that will be. Is it a hiring manager, a recruiter, a department lead, or an HR official? If you have an inside connection at the company you're applying for, ask them who you should address the letter to. And if you don't have an inside connection, hop on to LinkedIn to research the company and its team. It's pretty simple. You'll search the company on LinkedIn. You'll then review who the employees are, including their names and their position titles. And you'll use your best judgment as to which employee will likely be the one to interview you. And speaking of LinkedIn, if you're new to the platform, watch this video right here to learn 10 easy steps 
to help you build a strong LinkedIn profile that gets you noticed. I'll also place a link to the video down below. Now, if you've done your best, but still can't find any names or information about who your cover letter should be addressed to, don't stress. You can go with something like Dear Hiring Manager. The one thing you don't want to do is to have a greeting that says something like to whom it may concern. This is very outdated and very impersonal. And remember, if you don't yet have access to the Career Advancement Toolkit, I'll place a special link for you in the description below. Inside the toolkit, you'll find dozens of templates, including cover letter, resume, and interview follow-up templates, as well as instructions, guides, and video lessons to help you secure your next job offer. Now, the third step to write an amazing cover cover letter is to grab their attention by evoking emotion. The last thing you want to do is write a generic cover letter that looks like you copied and pasted some boring sentences you found online. Instead, spice things up by using strong statements and stories to express your relevant career history and your enthusiasm for the role. Following the initial greeting, your first paragraph can start with something like, after learning about your company's unique approach to online marketing from the June edition of Entrepreneur Magazine, I became very interested in the digital marketing manager position with your organization. Notice in this sentence, I'm letting them know about the position I'm applying for and how I learned about the position, but I'm doing it in a very unique and interesting way. Now, if you have any connections inside the company, the first paragraph is the perfect place to mention this. You could say something like Bobby Walters, who serves as the marketing director for company XYZ, knew of my strong expertise in this field and strongly encouraged me to apply for the digital marketing manager position. Just make sure before you mention Bobby Walters, or your connection on the inside that you get the green light first and that they're okay with you using their name. Now in the first paragraph, I also want you to express your love, excitement, or passion about the industry or company. Now I did mention love and excitement. This is the perfect place to let them know why you're applying for the position. Here's an example. I love that your organization values client privacy and fosters a team building environment. So if done well, your first paragraph will grab their attention by stating what position you're applying for, how you learned about the position and why you're applying for the position. Now, if you're enjoying this video so far, be sure to hit the like button down below. It tells me that I should create more videos just like this for you. Now, the fourth step to write an amazing cover letter is to show how you are the solution the company is looking for. One of the biggest mistakes I see job seekers make in their cover letters is that they focus too heavily on their why, why they want the position. While you should show your passion and enthusiasm, just like I mentioned in the previous step, be careful to not make the cover letter so much about you. Rather, you want to keep the focus on the company and the position and how you are going to help them solve some of their largest pain points. For example, don't focus on why you need the paycheck, why you want a new opportunity, or how happy you would be to work for the company. In the second paragraph of your cover letter, demonstrate how you can help solve some of the company's largest problems. To identify what their biggest needs are, read over the job description carefully, research the company's social presence, attend earnings calls, or ask others on the inside. Once you get a good idea of what some of their biggest pain points are, determine how your talents and your expertise can be an asset to the company. How do your relevant accomplishments and projects relate to this new position? What evidence can you provide of that? Show them why they need you. The fifth step to write an amazing cover letter is to tell a captivating career story. Stories are one of the best ways to captivate an audience. So in the third paragraph of your cover letter, use an antidote or a brief story to describe your background and show how you are uniquely qualified for the position. You want to convince how your passion and career experience aligns perfectly with what they are looking for. Here's an example of a sentence I could use in the third paragraph where I tell a story about an accomplishment. Last quarter, I had the privilege of implementing a new and innovative marketing campaign that targeted more than 50,000 potential clients. With a conversion rate of 42%, the campaign went off without a hitch. The great thing about this example is that I provide quantifiable results and employers love that. Whenever possible, you should speak the company's language. Take the time to look on their website at their values and mission statement and sprinkle in some of the words and phrases into your cover letter. This shows that you've done your homework and will demonstrate that you're the candidate they need. Now, if you're looking for ways to keep your cover letter to an appropriate length, remember this. Don't try to touch on every single detail listed in the job description. Your cover letter is not a checklist of your qualifications. Think of it as a mini sales presentation. You're touching on only the most important aspects of your career history and how they pertain to the position. So focus on one to two of the position's most important requirements and write about how you embody what they are searching for in their ideal candidate. 
And hey, quick heads up, if you're looking to connect with other professionals just like you, jump in and join my free private community on Facebook, The Career Club. It's the perfect place online to ask questions about anything career related, get feedback, share your wins, and build relationships. There are now over 12,000 amazing professionals in this community. I'll place a special link for you down below. The sixth step to write an amazing cover letter is to end with a strong call to action. Every cover letter should end with an assertive ask for an interview. The interview is where you have a real conversation with someone, dialogue back and forth, and continue to make a case as to why they should hire you. The interview process is also where you'll negotiate your dream job offer. So it's extremely important that you include a strong call to action to help you get to the next phase in the hiring process, which is an interview. Now this is normally done in the last paragraph of your cover letter and should look something like this. I would welcome an interview to learn more about the position and discuss how I could use my skills and experience to serve company XYZ in this role. I'd love to be a member of your team. Thank you for your time. I look forward to hearing from you soon. Warm regards and then sign with your name. Now remember your cover letter and resume are just the first steps to landing the job you really want. They can get you to the interview stage, which is where you'll negotiate a life-changing job offer, but you also need to be able to ace your next interview. So to do that, take a look at this video right here where you'll learn how to answer the most difficult interview questions. And don't forget to grab your copy of the Career Advancement Toolkit for some stellar video lessons, templates, guides, and instructions to help you land your next job offer a lot faster. I'll place a special limited time link for you in the description below. And if you like this video, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button down below. Be sure to subscribe to this channel for more videos just like this, and I'll see you in the next video.